Hey guys, PYT Keys here. So I just wanted to come with another video. Um, excuse how I look. Um, I am wigless, <laughs> but I have wanted to come and just show you guys how I actually apply my wig. I have the spray and the actual glue. And this is what those two products look like. And this is the spray and this is the glue. And um, you can pick these up from anywhere. Don't let them psych you out thinking that you have to buy them from Amazon or anything like that. When I was going to purchase from Amazon, I don't have free shipping. So it was going to be like $40. It was crazy. But then I started doing additional research. And I was like, I wonder if I could find this at like Walmart or something. And it had, they had it at Walmart, but they were all out of, at my location. Um, so then I checked other places that had it in my area. and. They had it at Walgreens and Target. So I went to Walgreens. I want to say this was like $5.99 and this was $6.99. Compared to what I was going to pay getting it from eBay or Amazon for like $40. Um, because of shipping and all that craziness. So yeah, it's very simple. So stay tuned. Alright, so first I have my wig. And this is the hair. This is the hair from Unice, Unice Hair Company. And it's just on a little mannequin and a little wig stand. And I'm um, first this on off. this wig is I have an elastic band. And um, so first I'm just going to take and put that elastic band on like this backwards style. So the wig is facing that way. And I'm going to flip it open. So, and there's the little lace front and that's the wig folks so yeah first we're just gonna put this elastic band it should not be white my mom picked me up white elastic and white elastic band I told her that I needed one and she was like okay I'll go by Michaels and then she brought me this white one I was like I need a black one so I don't recommend this although it doesn't really show I don't recommend this though so but yeah so we're just gonna put the band on first like that and then flip the wig back like that and for the most part it's already on but my personal preference is I don't like the wig to be moving around like I wore it the first week like that absolutely hated it I like to be secure I don't want someone who may be mad at me or something to come like pulling it off or and it kept sliding back the day that I wore it like this too so not satisfied with this so we are going to take our comb and just get it right so back a little bit like so you can see my edges are out but I don't want them to all be out just a little bit Because you do not want to get this stuff on your weave. So just pin it back and continue the process.
time to dry so just give it some time I don't like to blow dry it because that's just being unnecessary and putting heat damage to my hair when I can just wait it out so I'm just gonna wait it out <sighs> I got it in my hair you see that white residue that's what you don't want to happen but it's all right but I'm just gonna wait it out until it dries um, you can even like use it as a little edge control <laughs> But you do just have to let it dry because right now if I were to move the wig it would move because it's not dry. But I promise you when this stuff dries, it dries honey and this wig ain't going nowhere for a few days. You hear me? So just keep rubbing it in, pushing it down, making sure we get it down. In the meantime, I'm now just going to go in and correct my part and make it right for me. So, Alright, and so, in order to help, um, sorry, my air conditioning is so loud, but it gets so hot in here, so I have to go real fast. <laughs> but, and I keep looking here, and not here, here, not here, here, I should be looking here. Okay, so now, um, I just tied this down on it to help it dry quickly. Um, it's still a little damp, but I, for the sake of this video, we're going to just move on. Um, but let me, I actually could wear this one day. Like, this is kind of cute, right? This is really hot, but it's cute. <laughs> like, I would wear this in the winter or something like that. It's, it's really down. As flat as possible. I mean, that'll also help get your wig like laying super flat. Also, it's just to tie that down. Um, and then I have my Mac. Sorry. Sorry about that, guys. I just got a phone call. But yeah, so for the most part, the wig is dry. It's laying pretty flat here. This is my widow's peak. I'm just going to get some um, edge control and lay that down. But this is pretty much how I lay my wigs for the most part. I'm still in love with this hair. Um, excited to wear it. Um, I don't know how I feel about this middle part. I'm considering changing it. Um, but for right now, it's okay. Um, and I just took a little bit of my MAC Skin Finish Foundation, um, and it's the, F, uh, the SPF 15 Foundation Match Master. Um, I don't know what color this is. A35, I think? I don't know. But, yeah, it's A35, I guess, and it's from MAC, and I just put a little bit on my brush, and I just marked it down the middle, so yeah blended it out and yeah i like it so far i'm still in love with this hair um and again i am just using the got to be glue spray and gel to lay my wig and honey it is working um so yeah if you guys have any questions or concerns um please don't um or please feel free to leave them down below don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe this video. And thank you so much for watching PYT Keys TV. I'm just kidding. It's not. I, please. I'm never going to say that again. That was so lame. But thank you so much for watching, guys. <laughs> Bye.